Sarah Jane Dunn was sacked from Hollyoaks last month, after refusing to leave racy content platform, OnlyFans. And on Friday, the 40-year-old joined Olivia Atwood, 30, in Manchester to film a new ITV documentary about the 18-plus subscription site. Olivia wore a textured blazer with cream trousers, and the former Hollyoaks actress wrapped up with a camel-colored coat worn over a sleek black dress. She wore a cream jumper beneath her mottled grey suit jacket and teamed her wide leg trousers with box fresh trainers. Sarah teamed her pencil dress with chunky black biker boots and carried her belongings in a crossbody bag. Both women were preen to perfection, with heavy makeup looks and their blonde dresses styled into glamorous curls. Cozy up in a frame X Ritz jumper like Olivia 585 pounds frame X Ritz Paris jumper shop it in navy. By now winter is in full swing so it's high time you pull your coziest threads out of retirement and start layering up. If your knitwear collection is looking a little lackluster this year then why not consider adding to it with a neutral knit, a la Olivia at Wood. Olivia was popped today wearing this tonal cream ensemble comprising wide leg trousers, a frame X Ritz Paris jumper, long line tweed blazer and chunky kicks. It's a look that sequel parts smart and casual. Fancy emulating the Love Island star? Sadly her cream jumper has since sold out, but the navy version is available to buy via Harrods. Simply click the product image to take a closer look and add it to your virtual basket. Alternatively, emulate Olivia with the help of our carousel. There you'll find equally cozy knitted jumpers from Polo Ralph Lauren, Kickers, Off-White and more. Mail Online may earn commission on sales from these product links. Now get one like it previous next 305 pounds Polo Ralph Lauren jumper at Farfetch Buy Now 125 pounds Calvin Klein jeans jumper at Littlewoods, now reduced to 100 pounds, Buy Now 278 pounds off white jumper at Satire Buy Now 45 pounds kickers jumper at Asus Buy Now at the end of August it was revealed that Olivia would be hosting a brand new ITV2 documentary probing into OnlyFans and sex sites. ITV2 boss Paul Mortimer tipped the reality star to become the new Stacey Dooley as she develops her presenting career, having previously appeared in her own reality show, Olivia Meets Her Match. Singing her praises at the Edinburgh TV Festival, Paul said of Olivia's new documentary, she is exploring. In a series of four films, the internet phenomena that is young women and men who are using it in order to make easy money. So it will be talking about things like OnlyFans and the internet porn sites. Sarah Jane was sacked her from Hollyoaks last month because she refused to leave the raunchy website OnlyFans. Following her ex, the star defended having an account on the 18 Plus subscription site, insisting that her content is no different to photos of her which are posted on Instagram or appear in Lads Mags. Appearing on Good Morning Britain, Sarah Jane, who played the role of Mandy Richardson on Off since 1996, argued, It's the kind of pictures I've done all my life and reiterated that it wasn't her decision to leave the Channel 4 soap. In a statement at the time, a Hollyoaks representative told The Sun, Hollyoaks is a youth-facing drama with many young viewers, who follow our cast very closely, both in the soap and outside of it. We take our responsibility to our young audience very seriously and therefore the show does not allow any Hollyoaks cast members to be active on certain 18 plus websites. We had hoped we could reach a resolution with Sarah that would allow her to remain in her role as Mandy, but we respect her choice to continue to produce content on OnlyFans. 
In the past four years since her return to the show her legacy character has been an integral part of some our most important storylines and we will be very sad to see her go.